This local sports report is presented by the MVP Football Academy, a proud supporter of high school football across the province. MVP Football Academy provides elite development opportunities and recruiting exposure for high school athletes looking to play at the next level. Follow their Facebook page, MVP Football Academy, and their Twitter account at MVPFA2016 for all all of their program updates. Hey, figured out his name by the end of this. Had a hell of a day, guys. Uh, one on ones, coverage, and pass rush killed. Had a couple few picks in the uh, Skelly period as well. Aliyah, come up here, man. Yay. Yay. Another rip shirt. Yeah, no, you don't need to rip it all off. You all got to censor that on there. Get a picture. <laughs> cover it, cover it. So next, we're going to move over to the defensive line. There we go. All right, so it was a pleasure coaching this D-line group. You guys are amazing. You guys picked it up quick. Um, you guys, I wish I could give you guys all awards, but fortunately I can't. Emma Young, you stood up. <laughs> Next up on the defensive side, we got the DBs, Coach Ben. This one was tight. There was definitely a few guys that was de deserving of this, especially in the one-on-one -on -one period. Okay, the one uh, that put some of the coaching to. Um, you know, and then had a great jump ball pick in the in the one one period. So it's going to be Tyson Paul. Yes, sir. Next up, we got the quarterback group with Coach Falls. This one's probably going to be tough too. Yeah. So uh, eight outstanding quarterbacks today, um, but one stood out, and he's actually just grade eleven. Uh, but he can flat out throw the ball with a lot of pace, incredible footwork. Nico Brown. <laughs> Next up, the best athletes in the camp, the offensive linemen. Coach Nesbitt. <laughs> so offensive line, uh, it was a great day. You're in the nickname of the fridge, Brett Miller. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Next up, wide receivers with Coach Galloway. Another tough decision, I'm sure. We, uh, I think we started with 15. I think we finished with 11. They put a lot of miles on today. Um, this young man had a great day. Ryan Hughes, come on. Up. Can we get him some weight gain protein? <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> and then next up, running backs, Coach Parks. Great group. Uh, yeah, we had a lot of fun. Definitely uh, this one player got a ton of leadership out of him uh, pretty much throughout the night. Uh, Dominic Wilsinski. Yeah. Yes, sir. That's three MVP. That's three MVP guys. Three MVP. I had nothing to do with anything. <laughs> Final thoughts from the camp, right? Great night, great effort, great competition, great coaching, right? Understand, as you go into your high school seasons, and those of you, you know, who are lucky enough to play in a summer football championship, you know, tomorrow or Sunday, right? You've now put a good body of work where you've had a lot of eyes on you from, you know, various universities, right? The best thing you can do from here is make sure you're checking your messages if the coaches are contacting you and reply in a timely fashion, right? It does no good for you to show out if the coach messages you and they can't get a hold of you and you don't reply, right? Make the most of your opportunities, right? 
take what you learned and then get better for your high school season and your summer championship, right? One last round of applause for your coaches and players. Right? Richard, give us an MVP breakdown. Yes, yes sir! Yes. For more highlights, visit our website, 519sportsonline.ca. Be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel and follow us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter.